let us try to solve this uh, question so uh, the question is like uh, what is the signed magnitude representation of this particular member so the binary equivalent signed magnitude representation so um, these are the options multiple choice options that are present so basically what it is representing is uh, uh, the whatever the comma is there before that this represents the sign of that particular uh, uh, number the binary uh, equivalent number so now <clears throat> 22.5625 is a positive number that means uh, the first number will always be zero so the options would be either of this so this is how we will uh, uh, come up with so it would be zero comma now how we would convert 22.5625 into a binary equivalent is that first we will take 22 and then uh, to convert into a binary to 11s are 22 with, with the remainder of 0 2 5s are 10 with the remainder of 1 2 2s are 4 with the remainder of 1 and then 2 1s are 2 with the remainder of 0 so when you represent from um, top to bottom 1 0 1 1 0 is what you get in 2 so that means 1 0 1 1 0 is what you get and then dot so definitely you can see here 1 0 1 1 0 is there so now uh, the key lies in determining uh, uh, the um, number after uh, decimal part so now after decimal the number is this 0 0.5625 so if you want to convert it to a decimal number so generally for converting a fractional number into a binary number um, what we do is 0 0.56 we will start multiplying this number with 2 so when you multiply this with 2 initially what you get is 1.125 so negate this one and take 0.125 and then multiply by 2 again you get 0 0.25 so here you cannot negate 1 so you take 0 0.25 so you have to do this until you get uh, you eliminate all the uh, decimal numbers after dot so 0 0.25 gives 0 0.5 and then taking 0 0.5 again into 2 gives 1.0 so there is no decimal number after this so if you represent this number it becomes 1001 of 2 so that means the total digit will be 10110.1001 so that means b is the answer